Hey everyone, it's Sarah with RegisterNurseRN.com and today I'm going to demonstrate how to find the carotid pulse point. And whenever you're assessing the pulse, you will be looking at a few things. One thing will be the rate, how fast is it, along with the strength, and you'll be grading it on a scale zero to three, with zero being absent, one plus it's weak, two plus it's normal, and three plus it's bounding. And then you'll want to look at the rhythm. Is it regular or irregular? And this artery is most commonly assessed during CPR in an adult. And it supplies our brain and our head with blood. Now, whenever you are assessing the carotid artery, you will assess each side at a time. You will not do it bilaterally because we don't want to stimulate the vagus nerve, which can drop the heart rate and decrease circulation to the brain. To find this pulse point, we'll use the landmarks of the jaw, because we're gonna go below the jaw. We're gonna have the patient tilt the head like this, and we're gonna find the trachea and the sternomastoid muscle. And we're gonna go in between that, and you will be able to feel, and you'll lightly just feel on the pulse. And then when you're done with that, you'll go to the other side and do the same thing. Okay, so that wraps up this video on how to check the carotid pulse point. And don't forget to check out our other videos on how to check the other pulse points on the body. Thank you so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more videos.